A major party is underway in the South Metro tonight. Twin Cities Summer Jam is a three-day festival for tens of thousands of people. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield is right there in the center of the action on the infield at Canterbury Park. How's the energy out there, Susan? Well, I'm going to show you, Amelia, because it's pretty good. Now, we're in between sets right now. The stage is behind me, but there is a major A-list lineup. And I got to tell you, I'm not the only one who's excited to listen once again to live music. Woo! Yeah! We're so excited! Yeah! The cities are alive with the sound of music, finally. I really think anything that brings us together right now is so sorely needed that festivals like Twin Cities Summer Jam is, it's going to be a healing thing. It has been for me already this year. Chris Hockey is a country recording artist and radio host. He helped launch what's turned into a large A-list festival in Shakopee, and he's so glad to be back amidst the crowds. I know that they were afraid of the, the, the pre-sale tickets. Um, but people are coming out, they're ready to go, they're ready to be together again, they're ready to, to see each other's faces, and I think celebrate making it through the great catastrophe of our lifetime. Some were so eager, they camped out, because there's so much to look forward to. Uh, Carrie Underwood, Zach Brown, just hanging out also. Tanya and her family settled in for the long weekend, repurposing their ice house for the heat. Besides it supposedly going to be 100 degrees, it's going to be good. And good it is, as the band finally plays on. Huge lineup here. Kip Moore about to take the stage, then Leonard Skinner tonight, Carrie Underwood tomorrow night, then Zach Brown on Saturday. And good news is there are still tickets available, so it is not too late. And I got to tell you, so far, the weather has cooperated. It certainly has. Well, I'll talk to Chris a little bit more about that, but enjoy it, Susan Elizabeth, while you're out there. Thank you.